Wednesday, September the 4th, 2019. Clerk, please call the roll. Calling the roll, Ms. Conwell? Here. Mr. Jones? Here. Ms. Brown? Here. Ms. Stevens? Ms. Stevens is absent at the moment. Ms. Simon? Ms. Simon is absent at the moment. Ms. Baker? Here. Mr. Miller? Here. Mr. Tuma? Here. Mr. Gallagher? Here. Mr. Schron? Mr. Schron is absent at the moment. Council President Brady? Here. You have a quorum. Thank you. Uh, is there any public comment? Yes, Mr. President. Uh, Ms. Liu? All right. Thank you. Hi. Good afternoon. Good afternoon. I'm glad to be here to see all the familiar faces here the people who are here answering the call of public service, helping people. Yes, we have multiple issues ongoing in our county. Finally, something may happen to certain issues, but something are still not happening for some other issues. Uh, yesterday morning, 7 a.m. at this shelter on the Payne Avenue, you have this person cussing, fussing, dragging her own hair, she was totally upset, and you can tell something was agitating her very badly. She and I, we passed each other. At that moment, I had a familiar feeling that I would probably get beaten up by her, just like lots of the times happened before. However, this time, this person, instead of turning around to get me, it was another person, uh, also not very big, getting beaten up very badly. Shelter service actually is important to help people out. However, after the 13 years of the previous service providers till now, nothing has ever been changed. Because fundamentally, just like our county jail problem and some other issues, if you keep the same mistakes going again and again, nothing will get changed. So if there's no funding, there's no other resources can help that, how about think about changing the method by itself? Having a service provider definitely is not solving the problem, actually that compound the problem. With my incident, for example, with this arm, I still cannot even get a bus pass to go to Metro Health for appointments or even nowadays they call occupational therapy. Sure, getting your uh, elbow dislocated is not an occupation, but as what Mr. Shrong have told us, a job is a job. Same thing. A life is a life. A health issue is a health issue. If we don't pay attention to the overall situation and we only pinpoint one dot here, one dot there, the problem will never be solved together. So I'm here to wish you guys continue doing the all good work However, the public hearing for our budget is coming up. I wish we can actually improve the way we use our fundings to get some of the serious uh, services properly funded to help the people in need. Thank you very much. Thank you. Madam Clerk. Uh... There, there is no one else. Okay. Uh, then let the record reflect that uh, Councilman Simon and Councilman Schron are present. Um, next item is um, executive session. All meetings of the Cuyahoga County Council are open to the public under the Ohio Open Meeting Laws. Under that law, Council may go into executive session during a meeting for specifically authorized purposes. During executive session, Council confers outside of the hearing of the public. Council may not make any decisions about any matters in executive session. All decisions are made in public. This afternoon, the Council will go into executive session to discuss pending or imminent litigation. During this time, our live stream will be down, and we ask all those not needed for the executive session to remain in council chambers. Council members will convene in the adjacent committee room A. We will re-enter the meeting once the executive session is ended. Is there a motion to go into executive session for the purpose of discussing pending or imminent litigation? So moved. And moved and seconded. Would the clerk please call the roll? Moving to executive session, Ms. Conwell? Yes. Mr. Jones? Yes. Ms. Brown? 
Ms. Stevens. Ms. Stevens is still absent at this time. Ms. Simon? Yes. Ms. Baker? Yes. Mr. Miller? Yes. Mr. Tuma? Yes. Mr. Gallagher? Yes. Mr. Schron? Yes. Council President Brady? Yes. Motion carries. Okay. All right, you guys. Um, ask for a uh, five minute break before we continue the meeting since we're sort of uh, getting reorganized and uh, taking on a different, um, some different issues. Okay, so we'll see you in about five minutes.